regret being myself. It just sucks that it wasn't enough. I am who I am, and there's someone out there who wants that. It was the first time you've seen that, huh? Yeah, I haven't seen that. <sighs> when you watch that, where, where do you go that makes you so emotional? I mean, going through this was the hardest thing I've ever done. And the one thing that kept me going through it all was Matt and our connection. And I genuinely was so confident, and I really thought he was going to meet my family because I, I wasn't paying attention to the other relationships in the house. And um, I know my personality is a lot uh, to handle. <laughs> and for him to be accepting of it, that's what you want, you know? And I've, I feel like I've settled so many times in the past or compromise my personality to fit the needs of a guy I was with. And, and this was just the first time I didn't have to do that. And it was just so easy, which is why I was just so shocked that he sent me home, because I just, I just didn't see it coming. What will those feelings be like when he comes out here tonight? Do you feel like you got closure? Is there something you want to say? I mean, watching it, I get it. I get where he's at and, and why he made the decision he did. It sucks because Timing's everything, and when I watch the show back and I see his date with Michelle or with Rachel, I don't know that I actually stood a chance timing-wise. You know, it looked like he was already getting there with other women. So what did this do to you? Where are you in all this now? It's hard because I'm now 30 years old, and you start questioning, like, why am I still single, you know? And, and this past year through the pandemic has been the first time I've just really embraced exactly who I am. And there is part of you that's like, is it me? You know, is, is there really someone who wants me for me? You know, and Matt was the first person I was able to be 110% myself with, and it, and it didn't work out. So that's tough, but I just have to remain hopeful that my person's still out there. Do you feel like you know what you truly want now? Oh, yeah. I mean, at the end of the day, we all just want to be loved. You know, and, and I never want to stop pursuing love. And I do feel like I'm in the prime version of who I am and I'm the most confident I've ever been. And, you know, I, I'm just missing my person. Well, I truly appreciate you being here. One thing I honestly have always appreciated about you, you wear your heart on your sleeve and you are undeniably always just you. Uh, truly, thank you very much.